what's up? This is the dog glitch. Um, I'm over by the giant knife. There's the knife right there. This is the last dog, so he's just sitting here. I'm going to run around and show you how to get into it. You can go that way. I like to just hop down here. And you just kind of walk and crouch. It's the easiest thing to do. If there's two dogs, the one will hit you. The one that's right here. But this guy won't hit you as long as you're in this corner. So just worry about taking out the dog right here. And you can do whatever with this guy. I'm going to run around because I need to get close to my spot. Um, so I can do my little thing. My little strategy that I do. Every round I like to start. I like to start all the way back at the very, very beginning. For some reason I think the zombies spawn over here more. When you do it that way. And I'll show you the reason why. Because they have to come up these steps and come to me right here. I spend most of my time right here. And up by the uh, giant knife. I'll show you a little bit of my strategy. I'll probably post a video here pretty soon, but. Just jump down when I get overwhelmed. If I don't turn the electricity on, I'll throw a monkey bomb. Throw a couple of grenades. Throw nuts with some bullets. Get back up here. Wait in the window. See how there's not many zombies. Take them on until you feel like you're getting overwhelmed. Try not to get it too many times because when you run, um, when you run away, you gotta stay to the right, and they hit you a couple times if you're uh, if you there's too many of them. So, but then I just come over to this spot, spin around, just start blasting them in a row. This is pretty much my strategy. It's uh, I can get pretty darn far. But yeah. That's pretty much it. That's the dog glitch and a little bit of my strategy, so have fun. Um, rate, comment, subscribe, and as a friend, whatever. Peace out.